Hey guys, how are you? So today, uh, the topic we have is uh, what was what was the topic? Oh yeah, I got it. So the topic we have is how to fix Premiere Pro from crashing. So there are certain type of crash, uh, the application crashes like Premiere and After Effects while launching, while editing, while export, while rendering. So there are a lot, but today uh, we'll discuss uh, a main one, which is while launching. So this is this video is dedicated for Windows user because that error only comes in Windows itself, not in Mac. So you must be thinking what is that error which is there in itself in windows only. So the error is whenever you launch the application on the splash screen you get an error like mswcp110.dll is missing. So what is that? So actually that is not something from Adobe itself it's from Microsoft. Uh, a file which runs in the backend. Uh, so this is not limited to Adobe application itself like Premiere, After Effects or so on. It is applicable for all of the applications which are running on the Microsoft platform. So what all we have to do here, you must have seen this error MSVCP DLL, MSVCP.dll missing. So there are some files in the backend that needs to be repaired and after that reboot is necessary we need to reboot the system so let's come on the system screen and i'll show you step by step how you can do it by yourself within just five minutes and once you repair 5 to 10 microsoft c++ file it depends how much c++ it's usually between 5 to 7 files so once you repair all of them you just need to perform a system reboot and then relaunch premiere make sure while you are performing all of your adobe applications are closed at that moment so let's begin so let's launch a uh, Premiere Pro application. So like this, the error comes in. So in that case, what we have to do? So let me show you how you can quickly fix it. So what you have to do, uh, it will give you an error. Once you hit OK, the application will automatically gonna close it. So after that, what you have to do, go to control panel, go to start menu and control panel. So here uh, you'll find uninstall a program, click on it. Here you'll find all of the programs which are installed on your machine. Uh, so here we have files, Microsoft Visual C++ files. So there are uh, two different type of files. The one with the with the icon like notification icon or so and the others are with the system icon that have a machine. So we only need to repair the Microsoft Visual C++ files which are there with the system icon. So you just have to double tap on it, hit yes and then it will give you a prompt, repair and uninstall. So just go ahead for repair. This will be like this. This will take some uh, a few minutes, I mean not minutes, few seconds to process on each. Uh, but uh, as I told you, there are uh, between five to seven files. So we see here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, almost seven files like this. So it's about to complete and the same way we have to go with the others too. It's done. Now close it. Okay. So here on some of them uh, you might get an option like uh, you might re uh, you might restart your system before you can use the software it's already giving you an instruction so you don't need to click on restart here because we have two files left that we need to repair so just click and repair and that is the last one because that is a desktop runtime which is not required to repair it now simply close all the panels save your work if you have anything to save and just perform a restart so go here and restart your machine and once the system will restart what you have to do is simply go ahead and launch premiere like this and this will just work fine like you can see here on my screen so loading and it's right there i'm on the home screen so if you face this type of error i mean it should be there so uh, this might have helped you uh, go ahead like share and subscribe the channel and if you have anything to add please uh, let me know in the comments below i'll personally review all of the comments so this was it and uh, hope you all like this content and this will help you somewhere so thank you for watching stay tuned uh, see you in the next one till then bye bye